have no fear. Despite the fact that fear is a universal human emotion and that it quite frankly serves us pretty well in this world, God commands us over 300 times in scripture to have no fear. Why? In Genesis, we find out that fear was never part of the plan. It's an effect of sin and not something that human beings were made for. Therefore, it makes perfect sense that it would be natural for a person to feel fear and use fear in order to survive in a cruel world. But for the person who's trying to live in harmony with their creator, fear is completely unnatural. So what do we do? How do we live fearlessly? I think one of the keys might be found in Matthew 18 verse 3, where Jesus says, we have to become like little children in order to enter the kingdom of God. And when you think about it, it makes sense because children, they rely upon their parents to construct their realities. If mom and dad say this is this way, well then it is this way. Likewise, we are supposed to become like children in that we allow God's reality to become our reality. So when God says, I love you, you're not alone. I will never leave you. It's all going to be okay in the end. Well, it is that way. That is reality. This may be the key to living fearlessly in a world that honestly gives us a lot of reason to fear. We refuse to accept anything as reality other than what our Father says is so. So here's your encouragement this week. Child of God, you are loved. You are not alone. That is your reality. Go live fearlessly.